Hey, hello friends, Ritesh here. Welcome to my channel again. This is the Cyclin Stank channel. In this video, I am telling about the swim bladder disease. This is a common but mostly seen issue in Malawi or other cichlids. Not only Malawi or uh, other cichlids, not only tropical fish. I am telling about all other fishes which is in fresh water. This, this is causes because of uh, many reasons behind that. Mal uh, I am telling about Malawi. There are many reasons like water condition, not a perfect environment, like healthy and mostly food. If you're keeping Malawi, then you need to understand never give them a more protein diet, any African variety, because uh, because of that will <coughs> damage your fish definitely. But uh, uh, question is that uh, really they don't need any protein in nature. Yes, the, they need it, uh, but enough amount and in the nature definitely nature handle everything uh, well more than human but what about when they are in aquarium right now i am going through that situations and most important thing we need to understand that what's reason behind that when you know that condition you can treat it well Swim bladder definitely happen most because of food conditions. In lockdown, I prefer them more protein diet. Yeah, some fish can digest it definitely, but some are not. But I strictly telling you, my friends, don't do or give them protein diet. Right now, I'm telling about how I cure this beautiful fish with a natural way. First of all, you need to separate it from your main tank because, because of of course in malawi tank there will be aggression this fish which suffering from swim bladder or any disease you need to keep them separately in a hospital tank which they can feel better and relax first i separate him in a hospital tank then put sponge filter in it if you using sponge filter which is a old one which is going on previously in your aquarium then it is the best because beneficial bacteria helps to fish to get well soon. Right now I am telling about this is a common and natural way because I am always thinking about that. I am always against the medicine which is harmful fishes most of time. Right now I am telling about how I cure him. First of all, I keep him separate then put little amount of a stone salt or you can say crystal salt which is a very natural. It helps to kill any toxic conditions in a water the next day first of all i change 20 percent water change uh, then i use magnesium sulfate of a one teaspoon keep remember my friends second and fourth day you have to keep magnesium sulfate in it one teaspoon remember it one teaspoon i want to say again and again here I use 15 gallon tank that's why I use one teaspoon I recommend you one teaspoon is a better to 15 or up to that gallon tanks also you have to keep your water temperature 26 degree not more and not less remember my friends this is a very important tip as well as you remember this during treatment you must not be feed them definitely you should not feed them after 5 or 6 day analyze fish conditions if he or if they act like before then give him little bit food and after 2 or 3 weeks uh, then he completely okay definitely add them in a main tank. My friends remember every disease can be controlled every disease can be beaten by any kind of a fish only you need to understand and never give up on that like that treatment i always getting success in swim bladder or any kind of a disease if you have any techniques uh, which uh, which is very natural share with us comment below thanks for joining stay blessed stay happy and stay tanked